very disappointing afternoon. Um, would you put it down to just a bad day at the office? Or how would you describe it? Uh, no, because I think it happens more often than not. You know, when we come away and the, the team we're playing against is, uh, you know, they're hard to beat. They, they're tough. They battle for everything. You know, they, they never stop running. They work for each other. It's showing you there how hard they work for the manager today was, you know, was tremendous. You know, it's good to see really. It's a pleasure to see. I thought they were outstanding today. I thought they were the better team. I thought they beat us in every position on the park. And we just wasn't we wasn't with it today. Was it just the, the lack of creation as well, sort of thing that didn't get didn't get your chances and bet that bit of luck sometimes that maybe the goal. Yeah, but you, I mean we can't you gotta make your own look, can't you? Yes. I mean we've been on a we've been on a great run. Uh, these are dying, you know, de desperate for the win, I suppose. Uh, but you can, I mean really the, the way they played today, with belief, with you know, drive, desire to go and chase the ball down, to go and win second balls, to go and fight for every. 50-50. Uh, it was, it was. Well, I suppose it was good to see from for them, you know. But uh, from our point of view, it was uh, we was just nowhere near it today. And you know, I suppose you've got to give them a bit of credit for that. Um, how do you pick these lads up now? Because I can imagine they're all very disappointed in there. Listen, we'll do our job. They've got to pick themselves up as well, you know, because at the end of the day, they're the football players, and you've got to believe that if they want to get to the position they are in the league and, and they want to go on, then they've got to be better. They've got to be better in training, they've got to be better in game time, they've got to be better preparation coming to the games, which we highlighted before, uh, before the game. So listen, these these are all different things that we're gonna be uh, we're gonna be working on and uh, explaining uh, and suppose at the end of the day you know they've got to, they've got to pick themselves up. Would you, would you and the coaching staff now take a step back and put the onus on the players sort of thing to pick themselves up like, as you just mentioned? Well, listen, we all do our job. We do it week in, week out. We always prepare them correctly, as we think. Uh, we've done everything that we believe. We give them uh, a game plan, you know, the process, what we what we believe was going to win us a game. For some unknown reason, you know, it wasn't, it didn't happen today for us. Uh, and, you know, sometimes you've got to give the opposition credit because they, they were better all over the park today than us. Um, you welcome back to Harry Winter, uh, Anton Forrester and uh, Carl Grover and all the way didn't end up making it onto the pitch. How big, how big of a boost will they yeah, be in the next couple of weeks? Yeah, definitely. It's good, it's good to see these players back. You know, uh, At the end of the day, you can see we was lacking a little bit today. Uh, so it's good to get people coming back and getting game time.